Hello, in this tutorial I will explain how you can create a dynamic home screen. So as you see here on my phone, we use Zooper widgets. At the top we see our current profile, we see our weather, a wallpaper and then other shortcuts. So when I'm home, I'm seeing Gmail, Chrome, Google+, Camera, Apps, Calls and Messages. So when I click on Chrome for example, my Chrome will open. As you see, when I click on Google+, Plus, my Google+, Plus will be opened. Ok, as you see, all those shortcuts works. So when I change my profile, all my shortcuts will change. In this tutorial, I will use only 4 shortcuts. So the Gmail, Chrome, Google+, Plus, and Camera will change. First of all, let's change our profile. So I gonna do this manually, you can do that automatically as well. So here I gonna set my car mode on. Remember something will happen and there is a voice speaking in the background. Don't worry about that. That's something that happens when I change my profile. So when I change it to on. Car mode is geactiveerd. Gelieve ook je smartphone in de oplader te steken. And you will see my home screen is changed as well. Here we see the current profile is car. And we see also here the wallpaper is changed. So as you see all the icons are changed as well. So for example when I click on play music. My play music will open. So as you see this is how it works. There are several ways to do this. But I'm gonna explain this in my way. Why? Because I control everything inside my tasker. So let me explain what you have to do. The first thing is going to your file manager. And here I'm inside my file manager. I'm inside the folder SD card pictures and I created another folder home screens. And inside home screen I see a folder icons and wallpaper and the icons for example I have home and car and outside those are my three profiles and for example in my home profile we see icon 1, icon 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. When I go back going to the car profile we see icon 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So those are the same names but those are other icons as well. When I go back to the wallpaper we see car and home for example, in car, we see a wallpaper, road, GPEG, and in the home folder, we see a home GPEG. Okay, I hope you understand this. So that's quite easy. That's the preparation you have to do. When you want another wallpaper, for example, upload it here and give it as name home.jpg. Okay, so we have done everything inside our file manager. That was the first thing. So also remember when you create those folders, remember the path because you need that later on inside your tasker. Now the second thing we have to do is configure our tasker. That's the main part of this tutorial. So let's open tasker and here I'm inside tasker. You will see here I have several tasks. Icon 1 shortcut, icon 2 shortcut etc etc and then we have icons car, icons home, outside and we have also load icons home screen. So I will explain all those things. So the first thing we are gonna create is for example icons home. So let's open that. When we are at home we are gonna do some actions and all those actions are the same. Remember that. So you see here three actions for the first icon, icon 1. Then we see three actions for the second icon etc etc. So the first thing we are gonna do is is a variable set variable icon 0 1 to the path where your icon is located so in my case SD card pictures home screen icons home icon 0 1 point PNG that's quite easy then the second thing we're gonna do is super widget pro variable so we're gonna configure that and we're gonna set here T icon 0 1 to variable icon 0 1 let's open that and you will see here the super variable is icon 0 1 and the super text 
will be variable icon 01. So that's quite easy. And we're gonna set also a super widget pro variable, another one. And let me open that. You will see here super widget variable is icon 01 text and our text is gmail okay and those are the things that you have to do with all the other icons as well so for this example we use for dynamic icons i'm going back you do the same for car outside etc etc so first of all try this with one icon then you can add multiple icons as well so in that action we're gonna set our text and we're gonna set our icon but now we have to configure also the link so we're gonna use icon 1, 2, 3 or 4 or multiple icons if you want. So when we click on the first item we're gonna trigger this task. So we're gonna open that and we're gonna do for example if where am I match home we're gonna use gmail launch application gmail else if we are outside we're gonna use evernote or when we are in the car we're gonna use car home ultra so this is a basic task as you know you have to do that also for the other shortcuts as well so those three tasks is created for changing your icons and your text and this is for the link also we have three separated tasks for the car home and outside but if you want you can merge it also in one task load icons home screen for example then you have to work with an if statement else statement etc etc so when I am at home we are gonna do all those things when we are outside we are gonna do those things and when we are in the car we are gonna use all those things so that's another way you can do it you can change how you want it so you can use all those separate tasks or you can only use one task for all those profiles okay so the main thing inside tasker is finished the only thing you need to do is trigger those actions so when i coming home we have to trigger that task so when i go to my task welcome home that's the main task where all the settings are located for my home profile so when i click on that you will see here several things but the first thing is we're gonna set where am i to home okay i'm using that otherwise i would have so many variables so i'm using only one variable where am i and that can be home outside or car so we're gonna set that that's the way i do it and then we're gonna set also the variable where am i to where am i super widget super widget variable is where am i and super widget text is where am i i'm doing this because you saw on the home screen at the top current profile is and then that name so we're gonna do that in those actions and then we're gonna load our icons home screen or load icons home if you want it so in this case i'm using the long task where all the icons are located home outside and car and then we're gonna do the other things the home settings as well also you have to do those tasks inside your enter task but also in your exit task for example we're gonna leave our home so for example when we are not in our car and we are outside we're gonna set where am i to outside super rigid variable again and then the load icons home screen and then we're gonna use the task outside so as you see here that's our profile name and then when we open our super widget layout and we see here change text manually click on that you will see here hashtag t where am i close hashtag and we use also tu inside brackets i'm using that code for uppercase okay that was the first thing and then our icons let's open that layout and you will see here several things so the first thing is icon one image and we use here icon one png 
and when we go to advanced you will see here dollar sign then our pet t icon and that pet is set inside our task and we close also with a dollar sign we use also b inside brackets because that's the absolute path of the bitmap that's for the icon for the text we're gonna open icon one text and we're gonna change that text manually as well and you will see here the same thing dollar sign and then we use hashtag t icon zero one text that's something we have set inside our task remember and then on our link we use here a rectangle and fully transparent and we use here the module when we tap that icon and we use here task shortcut so we use one of those shortcuts for the first one we use that shortcut for the second one we use that shortcut for the third one we use that one etc etc so this is how it works i hope you understood everything it was not that easy to explain because so many things will happen remember everything if you couldn't follow please watch this again so you can create home screen based on profiles for example this one was location profile but you can also create profiles for time etc etc i hope you like this video if you have any questions or comments leave that on my google plus community link is below if you are not a member of my community please join that we are almost at 1000 members and if you like it of course you can give it a thumbs up and i will see you later on see ya